An airplane accelerates down a runway. at 3.20 meters per second squared for 32.8 seconds until it finally lifts off the ground. And so here, my airplane is flying. Okay, determine the distance traveled before takeoff. Well, let's take a look. An airplane accelerates down a runway, so I, can, I know that it accelerates at a rate of 3.20 meters per second squared. And I know that it does that for 32.8 seconds, and then it lifts off the ground. The one thing that I don't know that isn't necessarily given to me is that the velocity initial is zero meters per second. Since all of this happens in the x-axis, I'm going to use red. Lost the initial in the x equals zero meters per second. Acceleration in the x equals 3.20 meters per second squared. And since time doesn't have a direction, I'm going to write it in black. 32.8 seconds. The one thing that I don't know is distance. That's displacement in the x equals question mark meters. And the equation I'm going to use is distance equals velocity initial times time plus one half acceleration times time squared. Now, I don't know what distance is for displacement, but I do know velocity is zero and time is 32.8 seconds plus I'm going to put this over 2. The acceleration is 3.20, and the time is 32.8, but I need to square it. Now, this because this is multiplied by 0, this blows up. I get a distance of 3.20 times 32.8 squared over 2. I use my calculator to solve that. I get a distance equals 3442.688 divided by 2. When I solve it, I get displacement in the x axis equals 3 equals 1721.5. And now, if I take a look at significant figures, I see that 3.20 is 3 sig figs, 3 sig figs. So my answer of 3 sig figs, 1, 7, 2. And then I need to include a 0 to represent the correct places in meters.